In this video, I'll show you how to relight someone's face as they move around within a shot, with Chromatic from Cormelt. Tracking can work on all kinds of things – faces, parts of cars, walls, anything that's approximately a flat surface. If you haven't used our tracking software before, we recommend you watch our Better Tracking tutorial, which is linked below. We'll be focusing on tracked correction here, but if you want to adjust an entire image, add as many adjustments as you want to the overall stack. To adjust only part of the image, like the face here, choose Inside Shape or Outside Shape from the first menu in the floating window, and then add any adjustment. Here, I'll add an HSL curves adjustment outside the shape to reduce exposure, and I'll make the change pretty obvious. In the inspector, you'll see that Use Mask is now ticked, and as long as the effect is selected in the inspector, you'll see the tracking interface from Cormelt's other mocker based products in the viewer. You can now select a circle, polygon, bezier, or freeform shape with the tools here on the left. Then you can track forward, backward, or both to select an object as it moves throughout a scene. Here, I'll move to the start of the clip and draw an oval to select most of the face. Though a little rotation and then softening with the blur mask slider in the inspector will help. With the playhead at the start of the clip and the mask in place, I'll track forward because this track is fairly simple. After tracking, the mask can be softened or turned down and I can completely change the adjustment stack on both the inside and the outside of the mask. Here, I'll add in another HSL curves on the inside of the shape for a little contrast. To see what I've done, I can drag this control here to switch between a before and after display. The uncorrected image is only shown while the mouse button is down, and it's a really good way to see if your changes have been effective. Chromatic's built in mocker tracking means that with a single plugin, you can now relight a face as a character moves around, add contrast to part of a background, and fix complex lighting problems even in a handheld shot. Tracking and simple colour correction has been available with other Cormelt plugins before, but Chromatic includes a far more powerful suite of controls. Chromatic is available now from Cormelt.com, and there's a free trial available. Thanks for watching.